Hey guys, this is Emerald Fire, and today I'm going to show you how to track team scores in real time. What this means is that whenever a player on a team is gaining or losing points, the team score will automatically update in the sidebar. Let me show you how this works. First, you're going to need to add your objective that you want to track the players on. For now, I'm just going to do an objective called points and it's going to be dummy, although it can be anything such as player kill count or death count, any objective criteria works. Now you need to add your team objective. This will definitely be a dummy because you're only using it to track teams. I'm going to call it team points, and if you want to, you can use the display name as the regular objective so you can have it look exactly the same in the sidebar. So I'll go ahead and name it points. And now I'll just do this. Okay, so now I have my two objectives, and these are my players. I have my red guys and my blue guys. I'm going to start with the blue guys because I haven't added the red team to the system yet. I will do that on camera. So for now, I'm going to give this guy 300 points, this guy 4,000 points, and I'm going to display their scores in the sidebar. If I switch over to the team score, you can see that the blue team has 4,300 points. And if I change their scores, say reset them to zero, it'll go back to zero and I can add them back and it will automatically update. I have another thing over here that will randomly add five points to one of these villagers scores. So it could be for the red guys, it could be for the blue guys but if it gets added to the red guys, nothing will happen because they're not being tracked. So let's switch over to individual view, and now we'll do this. See that guy added to a red guy and then a blue guy. Okay, and you see random villagers are getting five points. Now if I switch over to team scores, you can see that the blue villagers have their points, and if I continue doing this, it will randomly update the scores. Okay, now let's add the red team. It's really simple to add a team, all you need is a fill clock like this, and it's two command blocks per team. So to make this clock, just face in the positive x direction and copy these commands from the description. And now facing in that positive x direction again, you want to put on the left side this command block. So now just rename these to your objectives. This one, remember, is called team points. And this is the red team. You will also need to add whatever teams you have. So I've added the red team and the blue team, and I've already joined these villagers on it. If you don't know how to do that, I'll link a quick tutorial video in the description made by someone else. I don't know who yet. We'll just have to find it on YouTube. Okay, so now add the second command block. This will fill in with objective points, team objective, team points, and team red, and one more team over here. Okay, and now we should be all set up. Let's, uh, oh, if you look in the sidebar, you can see that red is currently displaying their random points that they got. If I add some more random points, you'll see it goes up if they get it. Now I can set their scores with these. So this will be one, this will be 20, and their team score will be 21. So if I set this, oh look at that, this guy's score was already 20. Okay, so now I can just add this, I can reset the scores, I can add them again, add this stuff, random, and so and so. And now it just updates in real time. And that's about it, that's all it does, that's all that's needed. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment and I will try to answer it. All the commands used are in the description, plus a link to a tutorial on how to set up teams and add players to them. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching, I hope it helped, and I will see you all next time.